The two best dishwashers are Mueller and Bosch. Both have their new innovations, like Bosch with their new power control spray arm, and Mueller's newish automatic detergent dispenser, the Autodose. In this video, you'll learn the differences in washing, drying, racking, and quietness, so you can decide which one is best for you and your family. But stay to the end to learn when you should buy either. It's kind of surprising. Let's start with reliability as we can actually measure it, and it's surprising. You're looking at service percentages based on 34,000 plus service calls logged by our service team just last year. We'll both talk about being the most reliable, best built in the last 20 years. LG is the most reliable with 3.5%. I'm not paid by LG to say that, by the way. That said, both are reliable with Bosch being better at 5.1% versus Meal at 6.7% versus 9.5% for dishwashers in general. 1.6% is not statistically high enough to convince you to buy a Bosch over Meal. However, Google service in your area to see which is more responsive when problems do occur. Before you see direct comparisons, Meal and Bosch now only compete from $12.99 to $17.99. Bosch is a less expensive 100 and 300 series from $5.49 to $11.99, while Meal has their best dishwashers from $2,000 to $35.99, and then their semi commercial dishwashers up to $6,000. They both have some commonalities, including good leak protection, stainless tubs in multiple styles. The cycles are almost identical between these two dishwashers. Meal has the quick intense wash in 58 minutes. Bosch has their speed 60 in 60 minutes. Both are quiet with Mila at the quietness standard of 44 decibels and Bosch technically a bit better at 42 decibels. But you won't hear either while watching TV in your living room in an open kitchen. The racks are similar with an adjustable middle rack. However, the top rack in the Mila is technically superior. It holds the silverware so they stay in place and not scratch each other during the wash. So if you're washing fine flatware, Miele is the better choice. Miele allows air into the sidewall of the dishwasher. The hot air is attracted to the cooler side and is dissipated as water drained. It's a good system. The door also pops open, allowing heat and residual moisture to escape. Bosch is the same system in their lesser 500 series. If you wash before going to bed, sometimes you have that thin coating of moisture in your glasses and dishes. That means the steam is converted to water, so an auto opening door will prevent that. But crystal dry is still the better option by pulling zeolite, that's a volcanic element, to absorb moisture and increase heat to dry even plastics. At one time, I didn't think anyone could improve on Miele's wash system. You have three full arms washing versus usually two in a sprinkler head, as is the case with Bosch. With the third rack directly under, I thought that was important, but Bosch reimagined their dishwashers with power control. The propeller looking object allows you to control the intensity of the wash from light, medium, or heavy in four separate quadr quadrants. You could even divide the rack to be half and half. So if you want to wash a dishwasher full of china and light wash, you can do that in a Bosch. If you want to scour a bunch of lasagna pans with a more intense spray, the Bosch power control will allow you to do that as well, or both at the same time. The Bosch Home Connect app will allow you to customize your cycles easily, including where the power control wash Bosch's. This year, Bosch lowered the price and added features, but this is a completely different comparison to the better 7000 series Mila. Bosch will be quieter, it's now 38 decibels versus 43 for the Mila. Remember, 44 is the standard for not hearing a dishwasher. Once again, cycles are similar. The Mila 50% cycle is cool as it is, it is a special sensor to figure out if it's a half or full load. Mila is more adjustable than Bosch in the bottom rack, the 3D cutlery tray is more flexible as well than Bosch's top rack. Meal is still excellent with now two ports on the bottom to allow air on either side instead of just one of the previous 5000 series. So the steamier air is dissipated faster, plus the automatic door opening. Bosch is still technically better with crystal drive for plastics, but not by much. The wash system is the same as the top with Mila have the three full spray arms versus two for Bosch and a sprinkler head. This dishwasher has the power control wash arm as well to control the intensity of the spray and is more flexible than the Mila. However, Mila adds a 20 load automatic detergent dispenser they dubbed the Autodose. Now I used to think dispensing was a given, but it's not as anyone who's seen their silverware with a half open pod can attest. Clients reported the cleanest dishes using Autodose because the dishwasher senses the perfect time to dispense detergent. So how do you decide between two excellent dishwashers? Before I get into that, one last 
Final deciding factor, let's review. Amila's racks are a bit better. They have a complete package of washing, drying, and racking. Their dispenser is the best on their better series. Bosch is a bit better drying with crystal drying and a more flexible wash system with power control. And you have two final considerations. Amila just announced a $250 rebate as they've recovered from their supply chain issues better than Bosch. They also have installation rebates as well on certain models. So there may be a $350 difference between the two brands, depending on when you buy your dishwasher. Lastly, check service. While both are reliable, getting them fixed competently is another story. So check service in your area before you buy. For more information about the Bosch Power Control Dishwasher, click this link. And thanks for watching.